All right, viewers, I've made a couple small changes in my camera here. I moved it over here by this stump, wired a post to it. Didn't have but just one rusty little piece of wire, but maybe it'll stay standing. Get a little bit closer to the deer to see if we can get a better angle at the critters from down there and closer up. Went out today and moved the camera a little bit on my camera number two where I can get a different shot at the critters at night. I got my Sony set up in front of the bird bath up here, see if I can get a little bit of bird video. I went out to the lawnmower junk pile today and collected two or three of those lawnmower handles. Took some hammer and pliers and channel locks whatever I thought I might need with me. I'm the llama, went out there. In the process of ripping one of them handles off, I took a big chunk out of my skin. I was talking to the doctor the other day about how thin my skin is. You know, when I was younger, just like anybody else, I guess, your skin is more elastic. When you get older, I don't know the science behind it. But basically, my skin doesn't rejuvenate the way it did when I was a young person. So just brush up with something real hard, my skin is thin, and I literally took out a chunk the size of a half a dollar right here of my dermis and epidermis right down to the fat. Looks kind of gross. I got it covered with two different band-aids and some uh, neosporin. But I'm all the time bumping myself, just like these two bumps here. They were bleeding this afternoon when I was out there. It doesn't take much to get me going. I, I was on blood thinners and I quit the blood thinners, but I'm still on aspirin for my heart problem. And I decided to wean myself off them blood thinners. The doctor said it would be okay. I've been three years, uh, well, over three years on the blood thinner. And he said, let's try it without it for a while. Since my heart's doing so good and holding steady, it was great. It costed me $400 a month anyway. I, something I can't afford anyway. Let's quit. So I quit the blood thinner. But my arm's a little sore. I'm not bruising up quite as bad as I was now that I've quit the blood thinner, but you can literally see through my skin. That's how thin it is. So my advice to young my young viewers out there is not to do what I done. I grew up in Florida and in the South. Many as a year I went all summer with no shirt on, constantly at the beach or the swimming pool with no shirt on. Didn't protect myself from the sun. And I'm paying the price now. I'm sure my skin would be in much better shape had I taken care of it. Don't be Mr. Macho like we were, and uh, it wasn't uncommon for me to be tanned as dark as a, somebody from down in the South America somewhere or something. My skin was really dark, and uh, it wasn't uncommon for me to, to be completely brown. Now, my, my skin is really suffering for that. I'm not whining about it, I'm just explaining the situation. Uh, nothing I can do about it. But now that I'm over 70, things are a lot different. I'm hoping to get a bird video out there. We've seen one hummingbird so far this year and I think he was just migrating through. Tomorrow I'll actually do a little bit of work on my lawnmower project. See how far we get along with that. I'm going to cut up some of my uh, lawnmower handles and deal with that first. One of my viewers suggested I go buy some angle iron. 
And I might do that too eventually. I'm just trying to be Mr. Cheapskate and cut some corners. Make do with what I got. If it works out, my principle will be uh, sound, even if the material that I use isn't. I can always go back and make another one. Make it better next time. The whole thing's a learning process anyway. Anyway, y'all follow along with me and let's see how this project comes out. Uh, one of my viewers down in Jacksonville, Doc Inc., he said, make it out of PVC. And that's something to consider too. But so far, I ain't got no money invested in it except for $20 for a big black pan I bought at Tractor Supply. Anyway, I'll put together some kind of vlog for y'all this afternoon. I do appreciate you tuning in. If you like my videos, take the time to subscribe and uh, reach down there and click the like button. It'd be greatly appreciated on my part. Tomorrow's Saturday. Let's all have a nice weekend. It's P. Walpar signing off.